guys, it's Cookie and welcome back to another video. In today's video, we are doing part 9 of reacting to Beanie Boo Customs. I cannot believe we're already at part 9. I feel like I just started this series, but I cannot wait to get into all the customs in this video. And if your custom isn't submitted in this video, please do not fret. It will definitely be included in another part. However, I will be trying to get through as many as possible. And if you want to submit your own custom to be featured in this series, you can wait until the end and I'll tell you all about how to do it. So without any further ado, let's get straight into the first custom. The first customs were submitted by Sunset and they've submitted Voxy and Bolt, as well as a little miniature younger Bolt. Voxy is so, so adorable. She is so detailed. I love the blue accents you've added to her. And I love the little flower. I think it looks so, so pretty. And I think my favorite thing about this custom is the little freckles you added. They are so, so cute. I love them. I really wish Ty made more mini roos with freckles. And oh my god, guys, Bolt is so adorable. His design is just so natural looking and he's just such a cute bee. I love the one ear that you colored in this dark gray and then the snout and the little feet. I think it just looks so so good on this Beanie Boo. And I love that you made a little mini version of him. It's so so cute. You did a really great job on these customs. The next submission was submitted by the Beanie Boo siblings and its name is Mocha. And it is this super adorable French bulldog they made. I think this design is so, so adorable. I love when customs are made with a chewy base. They always turn out so adorable. I love all the little brown patches you added to him. They look so cute. The next submission was submitted by Beanie Brew Playhouse and their names are Cedarwood and Tartar Sauce. These customs are so, so cool. They are so creative. I'm obsessed with the green accents on tartar sauce. I think it's so, so cute. I also love that you colored the inside of Cedarwood's ears. I think it looks so cool. The next customs were submitted by Blueberry the Beanie Boo. They submitted these three awesome customs. Their names are Milo, Grey, and Luna. These customs are so amazing and so, so creative. I really love the design of Luna. I love the purple and black. I think it looks so cool. I also love the little DIY crown you gave her. I think that is such a cute detail. You guys should know by now I'm a sucker for purple themed customs, so obviously I love this one. The next customs were submitted by Spirit and Fire Boos, and their names are Miller and Shadow. Miller is so, so adorable. I love how vibrant the yellow is. It's such a cool color to see on a Beanie Boo. And oh my god, the concept for Shadow is so cool. I love the extra eyes you added and honestly like everything about this Beanie Brew. The colors, the eyes, I love the details in the face. I think it looks so amazing. The red and black markings just look so, so cool. I really love this design. The next Beanie Brew was submitted by Beanie World and its name is Mango. This is such an adorable custom and I love the concept of this. I definitely think we need more fruit themed Beanie Brews because this is so cute. I also think that Zuzu was an awesome Beanie Boo to use as a base because the colors go so well with him. You did a really, really great job on this custom. I really love it. The next custom was submitted by Ethel Boos and it is this amazing mushroom cow custom. It is so, so adorable. I love the idea of this so much. The red is so, so vibrant and so beautiful. And I'm obsessed with the mushroom pattern over the eyes. I think it looks so cool. You did a really, really awesome job on this custom. It's so unique. Ethel Booze also submitted these two other customs called Spider and Cotton. And I love both of these designs so much. They both look so cool. I love the dark theme you gave Spider. I think it contrasts really nicely with like the light pink. And I'm also obsessed with the color palette of Cotton. I think it goes so nicely with the gray fur. Both of these customs are just so, so pretty and I love both of them. The next custom was submitted by Beanie Brew Lavender and its name is Ocean. And guys, I'm obsessed with seeing all these Ethel customs. You guys are so, so creative and this Beanie Brew is just so cool. 
I love the blue colors and also the darker green that's on her lower body. I think it looks so pretty. I'm also obsessed with the accessories you gave her. I think it looks so, so cool. I love how vibrant all the colors are on this Beanie Boo. It just looks so amazing. The next custom was submitted by Daisy Boos and its name is Ivy. I love the detail of the vines and little flowers going over her paws. I think that looks so, so cute. It's such a cool detail and I love how it looks on this Beanie Boo. I also love how vibrant the green is around the eyes. I love the shades of green you used. It looks really cool. And Daisy Boo has also submitted this custom. I love the head accessories, the pom-poms and the flowers. I think it looks so cool. The black markings on the face also look so cool. It really brings in all the black accents together. I think this is a really unique and cool idea for a custom. The next custom was submitted by Baby Funtime Foxy and its name is Aspen. And I am obsessed with the name. That is such a cool name. I love it so much. And the custom is so, so cute. It definitely reminds me of Skylar and I love that. I always love seeing the different shades of blue huskies you guys make. They're so, so cool and so unique every single time. I love the blue nose as well. It really ties this whole beanie boo together. You did a really good job. The next beanie boo was submitted by Tasha Boos and it is this really cool Giselle custom. I love the bandage texture you've added over the forehead and the mouth. And I also love that you actually added a paw print to her paw. I think that is such a cute detail. I just think this beanie boo is so unique and I've never seen anyone do something like this with it. The next customs were submitted by World of Beanie Brews and their names are Fireworks and Cheeto. I am obsessed with fireworks. I think it is such a cool and unique design. The colors you chose go so well together and I just love the patterns you added. He definitely gives off clown vibes but in the best way possible. I love the split dye nose as well and the accessories you gave him. They look so so good together. I'm also just obsessed with the striped tail. I think it looks so good. I also just love the color palette of Cheeto. I think the colors are so vibrant and pretty together. You did a really great job on these customs. And then we have a whole bunch of customs submitted by Nelly Ray's mom. But we'll be focusing on this one called Spooky. I think the color palette for this Beanie Boo is so, so pretty. I love how the pink looks against the black fur. It looks so, so pretty. I also love the pink shading you added around the eyes. I think that is such a cool detail and it really, really looks amazing. The next customs were submitted by Beanie World. We have Forest, Dolly, and Neon. All of these designs are so, so cool. They're all so unique and different. I love the amount of details you added to each of these. And I also love that Dolly and Neon kind of look like sisters. I also love the green you added on Forest. It really makes the orange pop. These customs are just so cool and unique. The next custom was submitted by Beanie Boo Collector, and it is this amazing angel custom. I'm obsessed with the metallic nose and the eyeliner. The wings on this are just so amazing as well. They are so, so detailed, and all the colors you used on this custom just go together so well. I love the metallic colors against the white. It really looks magical. I also love the silver hoops you added to the ears and the legs. It's such a cool detail to add. This custom idea was so unique and executed really, really well. And then we have another submission by Ethel Booz, and its name is Cosmic. It's this really, really cool Phoenix custom with some purple and blue accents. I love how you distributed the colors. I think it looks so, so cool. I just love when customs have that like ring of color around their eyes. I think it looks so amazing. I also love the ring around the neck and the different colored feet. I love the color combo for this Beanie Boo. I just love everything about it. It's really, really cute. And the last custom for this video was submitted by Lacey's Fun Time, and its name is Juniper. And it is this amazing porcupine custom. This idea is just so crazy cool. I love how you executed it as well. The fur on the back is just so cool. And I love how fluffy the fur looks. You also got great coverage on this Beanie Boo. Like the brown is so solid. And I love that the hands, feet, and inner ears are a little bit of a darker brown, maybe even a black. It's such a cool detail to add. And the green eyes, of course, just pop against these colors and look really, really good. So that will be all the customs 
reference for today's video. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. And a massive thank you to everyone that submitted customs to be featured in this video. And if you want to submit a custom of your own to be featured in this series, you can either DM me on Instagram. My Instagram is at cookie.booze. Or you can create a community post here on YouTube and tag me. My tag is cookie0714. And again, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I hope to see you guys next time. Bye!